this is the way I look at it. Suspensions are super critical because what you want is the shock being absorbed by the suspension and not being transferred into the unit itself. And the way to do that is to use the best suspension possible so that that's absorbing all the shock from the road. So to demonstrate how critical suspensions are for your trailer, today here at the Lippert headquarters, we have chosen three different trailers specifically to test ride quality our new independent suspension. We did a standard leaf spring suspension and we did a torsion axle suspension. We chose three different methods of quantifying what that ride quality was. The first one is seat of the pants. We also mounted an accelerometer to measure vertical articulation or vertical travel, vibration. And then we also used just a plain old glass of water and we observed what that water was experiencing while we were traversing all these different events. Today we're going to be moving around the same track at the same speed with different markers to maximize the impact on each different suspension. These markers of events will tell us how each unit is responding. The cameras will be synced for each driving test. The accelerometers measure acceleration. Basically it'll measure how fast the unit travels through an event. Sensors are placed right over the axle area. We have one on the floor. We have one on the counter. We also have one up on the roof. Those accelerometers provide concrete information and data on a ride experience and that we can then correlate with the user experience and what they are riding, what they're feeling on during the ride, what the driver is feeling, what the suspension's doing. That should all line up and to really kind of paint the story on how the product truly performs. After having been in all three different trailers, this is what the bottom line was. All three did their jobs. What was uh, awesome to experience was the independent suspension. So there was a heck of a lot less spike from a vertical travel standpoint versus the other two. It rebounds a heck of a lot better than the other two suspensions. So what you get is more travel with independent suspension and then quicker to rebound to keep the tires on the road independent suspension was definitely the best.